Hello everyone, this is Ivy with Telecam. An exciting news about our most popular controller keyboard, the TLC 50TC NDI has been upgraded for some new features. We really appreciate all the feedbacks and suggestions given from our customers so we could better solve your pain point. So back to the point and let me show you the three functions we've added to her. So firstly, let's power on the keyboard with our Ethernet cable. So as you can see, the first function we've added to the controller is the small adjustment on the LED screen. So the screen is rolling up when we are not controlling it. We designed this in order to protect the LED screen because when the screen has the same information showed up for an entire show, which could be hours, that may shorten its lifespan. So this function made the keyboard more durable. So the second function we've added to the keyboard, so as you can see, there are four keys with two functions to each key. So, um, Pay attention to this one, it used to be the empty flicker key and we changed it to the shift key. That means you are going to shift from the two functions uh, between each other. So press the shift key, you can see there is a little S on the LED screen. That means you are changing the video parameters or picture parameters such as sharpness, YDR, contrast and saturation and press it again, that means you are controlling the preset speed, PT speed, zoom speed, and also zoom in and zoom out. So now let me show you with our um, Telecam 4K PTZ camera. So the last new feature is my favorite, which can bring you great convenience, especially when you have more than seven PTZ cameras connected under your local network. You can quickly toggle between the cameras by changing the IP address of the according key to control them. So here you can see we uh, have seven uh, camera keys. So. The CAM1 is controlling the PTZ camera IP address is 192.168.2.188 and the camera 2 is controlling another PTZ camera on the section 2 and the IP address is 181. So if I want to change the camera 2 into 188, I just click 188 as you can see show here and tap 2 again. So now it's changing 188. So camera one is still changing, one, uh, controlling 188. If I want to change the camera one uh, to 181, I'm, I'm gonna show you again. I just need to tap 181 and camera one. So it changed to the camera 181. So. This, uh, by this way, you can quickly change the IP address of the according cam key. Especially when you have more than seven cameras, this would be great convenience. So those are the new features we added to the control keyboard. First one, the rolling LED screen and 
and the second one new functions controlled directly to the keys and the last one is you can quickly change the IP address of the CAM key you can download the new firmware on the link shows here and what do you think about that? Let us know your thoughts by dropping us a line below in the comment. Also, you can reach us um, via tele marketing at telecam.com to give us more suggestions on other telecam products. So don't forget to like and subscribe our channel if you are a telecam user or you're simply interested in learning more about our products. And thanks for watching. We will see you in the next video.